Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So back with the release of Firefox version 93 on Windows, currently we are sitting on version 133 in the stable channel. Back with version 93, Mozilla introduced a new tab unloading feature that works automatically in the background if it detects that system memory is low. Now currently in Mozilla Firefox, the nightly version, which is an early preview version, sitting on version 135, Mozilla now is working on a manual tab unloading feature that can be accessed by right clicking on a tab, which basically at the end of the day will let you speed up Firefox by freeing up memory and improving its performance manually instead of automatically in the background. Now how this all works is if we head to a tab and we right click on that, here you'll see unload tab. So if you click on that, you'll see I'll be switched to another tab because it will unload and free up the memory on that tab that I've just unloaded. And if you go back to the tab and you select it again, then obviously it will be then reloaded and um, that memory will kick into gear once again. Now if you want to unload multiple tabs at once, you can just use control and then just click on the relevant tabs. And then you just right click and it says unload three tabs and the same applies and I get switched to another tab and the memory of those three tabs then is unloaded and freed up. So that's in a nutshell more or less how this will work. So as mentioned previously it was automatically in the background. Now it's something you will have to do manually. And so instead of unloading tabs automatically basically Mozilla is leaving the option up to you. Now this may be a good or a bad thing. Um, because having the option to do it manually kind of puts you more in control, but when it did it automatically in the background, it was something you didn't have to kind of like remember. So it would just take care of that maintenance side of things, freeing up memory when needed on Windows. So it's going to be interesting to see how this um, pans out in the future. And it's still early days because this has just become available in the nightly version. So um, there is a good chance that this could be called something else in the future. And obviously, um, because it's still early days, there is a little bit of work to do on this feature. So I'll keep my eyes and ears to the ground with this one and let you know if I get any more info. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.